All right, guys, what's going on? Yep, I'm already back with another video. Um, have a lot of stuff here to open. Was trying to decide what to do. Uh, I got probably more hobby boxes than I've had in a while. But I figure after Undisputed, how are you going to follow that up with another hobby box? You're just not. Anything you pull is going to be probably disappointing. So I'm going to hold off on that. Uh, I do have a bunch of different blasters, but I decided that after the success of the last women's division break that I did, that I'd do a couple more that were in the queue. Whether these will be as good, who knows, or they'll go back to what they were. You know, but hopefully we will get something good either way. Uh, as I've been saying, there will be an auto no matter what. And in this case, there'll be a pretty cool uh, side story. And, nope, feels thick. But, as always, we've got to stay on the lookout for colored cards. Not even going to stop at the Evolution and Royal Rumble and all that. It's pretty much old hat at this point. Just want to see if we got any colored cards. And what the hit is. I would have did that, excuse me, we'll say if I got a colored card of Elizabeth, that might be a keeper as the Macho Man was one of my all-time favorites. So that might be something for the Macho Man display. And something I hadn't really thought about before. Obviously, we got the Wednesday Night Wars tomorrow night. I usually talk about that on Thursdays, where I guess we'll most likely be doing another break. I do have a lot of stuff here. I do want to spread it out, but at the same time, it's fun to open. We got Candace LeRae versus Zelina Vega. It's actually pretty cool. Got Alexa Bliss cashes in on Nia Jax. Again, these are all old hat. This looks like a, yeah, we got our colored card. It is a blue Peyton Royce, numbered 1825. So there you go. All right, let's see what our first hit is. Sarah Logan Matt Relic numbered to 50. So I guess it's not a horrible hit, and somehow I missed the pack. Go figure that. But didn't really miss anything. Let's get to our second box. Our next hit. Alright, let's see what our next 
Ooh, that feels like a thin one. So we are going to have an autograph. But still on the lookout for colored cards here. Sorry for the silence, just do not have a lot to talk about right now. Again, looks like we got an auto there, and there will be a very cool bonus and story at the end of this video. like we have a bronze Alicia Fox 25 of 75 so even though it's only a bronze it's another colored and numbered card which this set does seem to be good for I have been pretty hard on it but it does seem to be picking up a bit Down to our last three packs before they hit. All right, two packs. Actually, what we do have tonight, I don't know how many of you guys or gals watching this. Watch the program. We do have Total Divas. And I yes, I do watch the show. I find it entertaining. And especially with Carmella back on the cast. You know, and if any of that stuff is true. Because, you know, this is drama. Or, you know, it's a reality show. But as far as her being a homewrecker and people saying that. Uh, if that really happened think that's horrible because you just don't know what's going on behind the scenes behind closed doors okay it's like we finally got another auto this would probably be the third one out of all these blasters that I've opened and it's Natty it's a bronze 68 to 75 and actually, I'm going to say not too bad because I got one last year, but I like this one better with the profile. I really didn't like those action shots. So yeah, cool hit. Now let's get to the bonus. Oh, sorry for the glare, but this is our bonus. I did a trade for this Lacey Evans orange autograph card. Which is cool in and of itself, but wait, there's more. And yes, here's the more. I actually posted this on the museum Instagram. You can see at PW Museum. Uh, had a couple, really my comment, and from an account called Pro Wrestling Immortals. But right at the bottom, Lacey Evans herself, you see the blue check mark weighed in in character which I thought was hilarious and really cool and she's having fun with it and acknowledging it I like that and she also retweeted it which was very cool so here you can see it on the museum twitter which is at PW Museum 1 not going to go into where she retweeted it. It's one of the 11. Sorry for the glare again that you can see down there. Which when you get a retweet from a star. 
led to 100, and I don't know if you guys can see that, but 194 likes. So, big shout out to Lacey Evans. Uh, I liked her before anyway, but she is fast becoming uh, a favorite of mine right behind Carmella. Not just for her character, but for being super cool like this. Again, apologize for the glare. As always, thanks for watching. Keep checking back.